In this video, we'll take a closer look at Optiony's escalation policies. Optiony alerts Dev and Ops teams of issues using on-call schedules. When the person on call does not respond to an alert within a specified period of time, Optiony can use escalation policies to ensure issues receive the necessary attention. Escalation policies should be set up after on-call schedules have been defined. You can have different escalation policies to be used in a variety of situations. For example, here, we're going to set up an escalation policy to be used for urgent alerts. Immediately, when the alert is created, Optiony will notify the person who is on call according to our standard schedule. If this person does not respond within five minutes, we'll instruct Optiony to notify another team member. If the alert continues to go unacknowledged 10 minutes after creation, we'll notify the entire team. These three escalation steps should guarantee a response. But just to make sure, we can repeat the entire notification sequence up to 20 times. Additional options give you the ability to close the alert automatically if it's not acknowledged, or to continue escalating the alert until it's closed. Note the incredible level of flexibility. Here, Optiony can be instructed to notify a specific user, the next or previous person on call, a team admin, or even a random person on the team. You can even notify teams in other schedules. Whatever the escalation flow you desire, you can easily set it up in Optiony. It is important to note that you can have multiple escalation policies for each team. Here, we have a policy for alerts of moderate or low priority. It provides more time, up to a half hour, for the responder to acknowledge the alert before escalating to the next user. And at no point will we alert the entire team. Optiony determines which escalation policy to use through its routing rules, which we'll cover in another video. You can experience escalation policies for yourself today by signing up for a free 14-day trial of Optiony.